palatability is generally used as like a subjective term, how appealing or how pleasant, you know, it is to ingest a specific food. The distinction is that with hyper palatable foods, they contain combinations of nutrients that don't occur together in nature. So nutrients that can together kind of exaggerate the flavor profile of a food. So those would be combinations of fat and sodium, fat and sugar, and carbohydrates and sodium. These foods have these combinations of palatability-inducing nutrients that occur at like moderate to high thresholds, and that is very distinct from foods that are found in nature, which typically just have one single palatability-related nutrient. And so together, those nutrients, the premise is that they can create an artificially kind of exaggerated, highly, highly palatable eating occasion. (laughs) 